Okay, I've got a fresh installation of Kodi 16.1. I'm not using 17 myself as yet. I'm just going to go through the install of iView Wizard in preparation for the new version that we're releasing very shortly. So I'll go to File Manager. Let's add the source as normal. HTTP colon forward slash forward slash iViewTVGuide.com forward slash install click on done so iviewtvguide.com forward slash install and we'll call it install iview repo done okay that's it go across the system add-ons install from zip the one that we just added here install iview repo and click it same installation routine as always nothing's changed it'll say here that it's active once it's done there we go so now install from repository iView TV guide and we're going to add for now we're going to add the wizard because you'll see here we haven't pushed the update so it's still on 3.07 so let's just install the wizard install that's done so if we click it Click open. Go to iView Tools and then install iView TV Guide and associated add ons. Click. It's going to download and extract. I'll pause the video for a second so you're not uh, waiting too long. Okay, that's downloaded. Now it's going to extract. The files are around about 60 megabytes, it shouldn't take too long. Okay, once this is done, very important that we close Kodi and we open it back up. So that's done. Let's close and open it back up. There we go. We'll see now that if we go into video add ons, it's installed a few of the add ons just to get you going basically. Okay, so now we'll run the guide. You'll see that we're on the new version. So if we click that, currently it's going to download the default skin. I'm changing this to the UV the U view skin shortly, so it won't look like this anyway. You'll see what it'll look like on the on the next run. Because we have to make it download the files that it needs. But it will only do this once. Okay, that's loaded. Okay, so we're going to come out of there. So I had to pause there. Uh, okay, run it again. It's going to download the latest skin pack, all the files that we need then to continue. Okay, there we go. That's going to be the default skin, and uh, that's literally ready to go. Let me move this up a little bit. Sorry about that. Okay, if we press uh, context menu, see all of these would have been installed with the wizard, so they will just work. Okay, every single one of those is working. They have a slight small issue on Match Center that it's opening up uh, a search box behind, but we'll sort that before release. Okay, you'll see here edit shortcuts. I won't go into too much detail, this is just showcasing the installation by the wizard, but you can edit the shortcuts and put them to however you want them. You've got add-ons that you're using more often, subscription add-ons, free add-ons, whatever you like. You can just change them in here. What you will have to do is add them to favorites first. And once you've added them to favorites, they will show in this list here the ones that you want to be able to choose. Okay. So we can reset that to blank. If I had something in favorites, I could edit shortcut. 
I can reset it back to the defaults or again if I had it in favorites I could just choose the one I wanted and that will set it back for now there we go that's how to use the Ivy wizard for a quick fresh install along with uh, the add-ons that you need just to get going because we've installed the, the film on then uh, when you click on a channel it will just prompt you for the moment to choose the film on okay well we'll look forward to releasing it later and I'll uh, update with some more videos shortly thanks all take care